Hello my friends from the Churrasqueadas channel. Our recipe for the day is Brazilian style fried chicken with mashed potatoes. Do you know the origin of the name Frango a Passarinho? I am going to quiz you guys and I want to know if you're good at it. Where did the name Frango a Passarinho come from? Italy, Germany, Brazil, Portugal. What is the correct country? In a while, I'll give you the answer. But this fried chicken today, we are going to use the dry rub seasoning. It's a great dry seasoning. You can use a good amount of it here, okay? We are also going to use another very nice seasoning, which is pepper. Hey, that's great. This pepper here is mild taste, so we can use lots of it. Let's mix them up. Brazilian styled fried chicken is prepared everywhere here in Brazil. We cut the chicken in little parts like these, okay? As I said before, this kind of chicken is prepared all around Brazil. How do you prepare your frango a passarinho? I want to know, let me know. Share with us. Dry rub is nothing more than a mix of various different spices. We have ginger, we have malt, hops, the products that are used in beer. Here we have on this dry rub seasoning. That's great. And there's even orange powder in this. So we can have that special taste. All seasoned. Let it stand there for 20 minutes. Now we go there, light up our barbecue grill. Let's use a good quality gel alcohol, just a little, right in the middle of the grill. Light up a match. Don't let your brother-in-law next to it. It's time for our chicken to be ready and the dry rub so that it can be grilled. Our grill temperature is set. Let's get our chicken. And along with it, we have mashed potatoes. We are going to get some potatoes, get some aluminum foil paper, right? The shiny side up. Let's wrap them very well wrapped. Brazilian style fried chicken is here. To the grill. And the potato right here, it's literally on the fire. Put them in the corners of the barbecue grill. We are going to roast this chicken in medium temperature, okay? Chicken usually grills slowly. First, you put the bones down, okay? If there's no bone, you put it on the other side. In a little while, we will turn them around, get the potatoes to make our mashed potatoes, and after, chomp on it! Have you subscribed to our channel yet? Not yet! Sign up and don't forget to click on the bell. You will get a notification whenever we have a new recipe. Hi, Hudson Lima. I remember you. You are a very smart guy. You don't miss our show, right? Because you know what is good. Thank you, Hudson Lima. A big hug for you, my friend. And you there, Ildo Perli. The face of my brother-in-law here. You don't want to see it, a silly boy. Your brother-in-law, Solus Christus official Edson Dutra, asks us to grill steak with eggs. I am going to do it with eggs, especially for you, okay? Ricardo Santos, I am a singer, sir. Yes, I am. You know, come on, I'll sing you a song. My heart that loves you, Tiago de Lima, that saliva. It's so tasty. Don't you do that when you eat something delicious? Come on. Felipe Moraes, Moisés da Silva. I'll spell baking powder for you. Look, first is baking powder. You misspelled it. I am going to spell it right for you. B-A-K-I-N-G-S-O-D-A. I love when you guys share, when you guys leave your comments, send recipes. Let's go get our potatoes from the grill. Be very careful not to burn yourself. Let's prepare our mashed potatoes. You are going to get the potatoes here. Let's peel them. They are cooked. That's just beautiful. 
My friends, look, we peeled the hot potato. You can see the smoke there, look. Now we are going to mash them, you see? That stops. Let's prepare the mashed potatoes. After smashing the potatoes, we are going to use our frying pan here. Melting butter here, look. Now we are going to fry chopped garlic, that sweet sizzling sound. I love garlic, especially on the mashed potatoes. We will also add onions here, okay? How about the quiz answer? What is the origin of the name frango a passarinho? It's from Italy. They call it pollo aluceletto, capiche. <laughs> it is nothing but the frango a passarinho. After frying the garlic and the onion, we will get the potato, okay? Put it right here in the middle. Let's mix them here. Let's add milk, cow's milk, some more milk here. It will soften and form the consistency of the mashed potatoes. A little bit of salt here, okay, right? Some black pepper also to give that special color, that special taste. Don't you like black pepper? So you don't have to add it, okay? No problem. Check out the consistency of our mashed potatoes. Now we are going to get our polo aluceletto. Don't you tell me we burned the chicken. When we use the dry rub seasoning, it forms this wonderful crust, which is nothing more than a caramelized crust. Our mashed potato is here. Guys, you have to prepare it. Here, you can get a big piece of chicken, this chicken here with mashed potatoes. Look, check this out. Whoa, what a delicious smell, yummy. Mm. Mm. Good, very good. Prepare it, good barbecue. Cheers. Look, barbecue friends. While our chicken is while our chicken is <laughs> so does our boss doesn't he not anymore okay <clears throat> the English chicken how do you say that chicken there's a really cool thing about the day June seventh go to the post there. The promotion post, search, search for, do you want to participate? Look for the promotion post there on Instagram and participate. That's it. But I have already said participate. That's not right. Participate. I'll have to stop to wash the spoon. Look here. All covered in rice. Can this happen? The spoon is full of butter. We won't be able to lose it. Spoon, some paper tower, please. Some paper tower staff, please. I forgot to do this before. Oh, my. 